Hello everybody, this is Kara, Southern Sass Vinyl. Uh, today we're going to talk about how to update, or I'm sorry, how to um, upload a ICC profile into um, AcroRep. Okay, so I've already downloaded the ICC profile um, from Vibrant Vibes Inc. So here it is right here. Okay. And so you're going to have, AcroRip is going to be closed. And you're going to come down here or wherever you want to do it. And you're going to type in C colon. And it's going to come up with run command. You're going to hit enter. Okay. So you're going to find the root folder for DTG rip. And then you're going to go to profile. And you're going to click uh, CMYK. And this is where all of your ICC profiles are. I store my ICC profiles um, whenever I get them. I take them out of my download folder and I have a specific folder set up um, in my graphics, or I'm sorry, um, where I store my graphics and stuff. That way they're always easy to find and if I accidentally delete one from the software, it's, it's right here and I can just go and get it. So for this, now you're just going to drag and drop it. Okay in there get out of that you're going to open up your DTG rip okay so when you come to color scroll down you're going to click on ICC profile you would click use and there it is right there that's the one we just uploaded and so this one this one this one and this bottom one those already come pre-installed uh, and that's for the, the DTF Pro uh, inks. So I use Kingdom DTF. Um, he has two. He has one for glossy film and one for matte film. And this is denoted by the G and the M right here. And then whenever I use uh, Vibrant Vibes ink, of course, I'll use this, I, this ICC profile. I haven't really seen a major difference um, in between the two inks and between Vibrant Vibes and Kingdom DTF as far as color consistency and um, I kind of interchange the inks. I prefer Kingdom DTF ink but if I but I prefer Vibrant Vibes uh, cleaning solution because it comes in the bigger the bigger bottles and so it just depends on if I need cleaning solution and I'm ordering from Vibrant Vibes then I'll just go ahead and order their ink. Um, it's never recommended to mix inks however I do it between those two just because like I said I, after testing them um, on several different machines just I'm not seeing a massive difference in between them as far as the color um, and the color quality and what the difference is in between the two ICC profiles so usually whenever I'm printing I just choose the Kingdom DTF I use his glossy film so I just choose the glossy and I, I do that no matter which ink I have in there like I said, it's not recommended that you mix inks because they are um, formulated differently. But, I mean, it's not the end of the world if you don't. You just need to know, figure out which ICC profile works best when you do that. Um, and for me, it's just the Kingdom DTF um, ICC profile. Alright, so that's it for this video. If you have any questions, as always, you can reach out to me at sassyvinylhtv at gmail.com or via my website at southernsassvinyl.com and then just select the contact, um, contact us button. Thank you so much.